You're watching In this show I'm going to show you how I'm painting a portrait of five children. They're the children of a grandfather. And this grandfather is a very special person in the art world. He taught on a few of the best academies of the world. For instance the Rietveld Academy in Amsterdam. So it does make me a little bit nervous to make a portrait for such an important person. But also in this show I went out for my morning walk and I realized something was missing there in the forest. If you want to know what's missing, keep watching. Now I also wanted to look for um, edible mushrooms but I can't find any and that's strange. Normally last year I was here it was filled with mushrooms but now I can't see any. It almost feels like looking for a lost friend. Every year I meet with my friend here in the forest and now he's not there. Why? What happened to him? Dear mushroom if you see this movie, let me know where you are. Maybe you come back a little bit later. Where are the mushrooms? Hello, I'm a tree trunk and I'm smiling. Where are the Ah, finally, there it is. But I'm very happy that at last I found a a mushroom after all. This is a fly a fly a woodrick. Wooder wood wood garrick. Wood uh, wooden. I'm very happy. I just met a guy who said probably the reason why you don't see so many mushrooms in the forest right now is because it has been dry for quite a while. That sounds like a good reason. <laughs> How especially missing this one that you can eat and this one that looks so pretty. And now I'm going to the gallery. working on a commission for a very very special man he is the grandfather of these five children and his name is Peter Koene Peter Koene Peter Koene is a chemist and a science philosopher since 1971 Mr. Koene has been a teacher on the Rietveld Academie in Amsterdam, Jan van Eyck Academie in Maastricht, Amsterdamse Hogeschool van Kunst en Masteropleiding van Restauratie van de Universiteit van Amsterdam. Besides that, he has been a substitute teacher internationally teaching in a lot of academies all over the world. Often his advice is asked when there is a big restoration project for very special historical paintings. You can imagine how proud I am for such a man to ask me to paint his grandchildren. I'm very proud but I must say also a bit stressed because this needs to be more perfect than perfect. But then I just have to let it all go and paint with the flow.
So I met Peter at a course. I wanted to learn more about making paint, how to make your own paint, and how to deal with pigments and all that kind of things, and have a deeper scientific understanding about the materials I work with. The course was at the Zaanse Schans, Verfmolen de Kat, Windmill the Cat. Verfmolen de Kat. It's a windmill where they press pigments. It's the place where I buy my pigments and also the place where Peter Koenig gives a course once in a while. If you want to know more about these courses and if you maybe want to follow one of these courses, you can go to this website or send me an email. And Verfmolen de Kat is also the place where I bought my lapis lazuli. But you can also just visit the windmill as a touristic attraction or to buy pigments. It's very beautiful there. And then later I met him in front of the Fundatie, the museum. We went to the same show of Turner. And I invited him to come to my gallery and he did. And he really liked my paintings. So then he asked me to do this. Yeah. 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 Yeah.